How's it going, already? When Jersey Road some more Wolf 3 u and the last episode we played as, well, this awesome character, Ying Long. He's actually a lot of fun. I like his design as well. And uh, they had a little cutscene where he spoke with Tamamo, which was kind of weird, which is uh, giving me a bad idea about this next episode. So let's see what these people have to say. I don't see anyone else in town, but I will keep an eye out for the future in case they do have some more secret stages out here or something like that. I wonder if when I'm fully, you know, like done with the game, do I get to choose which camp I can stay in? Can I stay in the, the beat up Orochi camp? Can I stay in the good Orochi camp? Or can I stay in a Mystic Realm? Or do they force me to stay in a Mystic Realm is the question. So, we will find all this out in due time. So, I need to say Wenji. Ah, Mitsuhide and Sumayi. That's perfectly fine with me. You and Mitsuhide. Where are you? Wow. <clears throat> we have not played Mitsuhide once yet. So this is pretty crazy. Oh, we got the pimp. Holy crap. I might roll out with the pimp today. Depends. See what kind of mood I'm in with the costumes. I do like this one. I think this is a uh, Dynasty Warrior 6? I don't know. Oh, that one's not bad either. I might be wrong. This I might be wrong which one's which. I don't know. Oh man. Didn't Sumi used to have a sword at one point? I think in DW3 or something? Or did he always have a fan? I don't remember. I don't mind being the pimp. We could pimp it out again. That's a pretty good costume. Ah, the banana. It looked good on her. Ooh, wow. It's quite nice. A schoolgirl. You know what? Actually, it's not really a schoolgirl, but we'll take it. Hello, Mitsuhide. I actually like this armor a lot. I don't know what this one. That's a nice one. Now, uh, I believe while I was offline, let's, let's speak to these people here. While I was offline, I did equip them with the weapons and items, I believe I did, so I'm just gonna do a quick check. And if that's fine, I just have to level them up and we can just get started. So. <clears throat> Hello, Joe Tai. You seem to take great care in maintaining your sword. May I see it for a moment? No. My apologies. <laughs> so, uh, what if Joe Tai said, yeah, you can see it in battle or something? That's something I could see him saying. Danmaru Mori. <laughs> Annoying. <laughs> um, Alright. Let's make sure. Yes, I did give them stuff while I was offline. Perfect. Now I just have to level everyone up to 45. Or wait, we're in the new chapter, aren't we? Yes, we are. I think uh, I think I did say 50 is the new thing now. I guess for every new chapter we'll go up five levels or something. I don't know. Maybe maybe 50 is pushing it. But uh, we should be good to go here. No one's 50. Everyone has good stuff. Yeah, we are prepared. Let's uh, actually... Let me save. Because, you know, we did a bunch of stuff here. Begin advance. Rescue of the Heavenly Emperor. The Heavenly Emperor's palace has been overrun by demons. Save him and change history for the better. Well, I hope we can save him. Following the victory against the demons, Ying Long, has, who was concerned about the Heavenly Emperor, went on ahead to the Heavenly Emperor's castle. Fuxi and the heroes of the human realm pursued Ying Long. Wait, pursued us? Pursued me? Why? Before long, I saw a huge horde of demons inside the castle. At this awful sight, Fuxi was certain 
that this was the moment that the Heavenly Emperor was to perish. I mean, how strong was the Heavenly Emperor? Was he just a symbol? He was just like a guy that was the leader, but he wasn't really powerful at all or had much powers? Or, I don't know, I would like to know more about the Heavenly Emperor, actually. Maybe make him a playable character in the future, if, if, that, uh, if that would be allowed. But uh, if they did not act quickly, the same unfortunate event would occur, reoccur. Huxi and the heroes of the human realm hurried to the heavenly emperor. There are deem demonic melodies resonating throughout the castle. In fact, there are too many to count. It is like Lord of the Rings or something, you know? Like they're all surrounding your castle walls. And... That'd be cool if, demons, if the demons did some crazy stuff. Like, you know what they should do? Like, you know how they have the story? Um, I want to play as everyone's side. I know we're doing like the mystic story right now, but I sort of want to play as Ying Long and see his personal side of it and see what he's actually going through right now and stuff like that. Same thing with the demons like uh, Tamamo. I want to play missions as her and see her background story. How did she even become evil? Was she just. She was just born and she's like, I hate everybody. And, you know, it's, I just wanna, I would like more of that in Warriors Orochi 4, like more, uh, more in-depth story. I think more in-depth story would make the game more interesting and make some other characters that are, I guess you could say, underrated, more enjoyable. Like, uh, for example, a generic officer in Samurai Warriors 4 really has grabbed my attention. Kagatora, if you guys have been watching my playthrough. So someone, the, look how the story just, he's just a generic officer. What, what would I care about him? I don't even get to play as him. But the story made him so much interesting that, than a lot of the real characters you could play as. And uh, that's sort of what I'm looking for in future uh, Warriors games. And I hope we get to that stage eventually. And what the hell is this? This is a weird map. But I hope you guys are understanding where I'm coming from with that. But I think I think we could use more in-depth stories here. It's nice. I like all the funny cutscenes. The funny. Keep the jokes. Keep all that stuff. Keep the serious stuff. Keep it all. But I just want a little bit more story. And, you know, I, I want the story to grab my attention like the Yusugi uh, storyline did in Samurai Warriors 4. But uh, let's get started. Shushu, bless us, please. Gonna have to run harder than that, man. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, he knows what the mirror does. Leave Tamamo? Oh my god, are you gonna be the one that kills the Majesty? <clears throat> that would really suck. What's going on? Hello, Denise. <laughs> I'm looking for some new hoes. Just trying to get pimped out. I'm a kitty. Yeah, well, there's a Dragon Ball or something. There. Yeah. You like when I fly through, yeah? Kagewane. 
Oh, interesting. Uh huh. What? What was that? Like, that was. The things are just floating here. I feel like I can collect them. Like, if it's another game or something. Like, yeah, just pick them up. All right. Let's go for these bridges. Give out on us. Oh, what? There's a lot of climbing to do. I wonder if it activates when we defeat certain officers, or... Are we gonna have to do some stuff here? You know, this is a really underrated character. She's really good, guys. I know I have some viewers that dislike playing female characters, but you're, you're missing out, man, honestly. Some of these ladies are better than the dudes. Hello. Get stunned, homie. <laughs> guy just chopped me out of nowhere in the middle of the crowd too. Oh man, what the hell is your problemo? Oh come on man, don't do this to me. Dude, I'm just trying to do my triangle move man. You're making this very difficult. Thank you, holy crapola. I just want to do that. Jeez, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Where's this guy going? Onikuma. Oh, good night, buddy. We got some music right up the ass. Does that feel, huh? Guy, a magician man. I gotta let him heal a little bit. Oh, we're trying to go this way, but this gate is locked. So, oh, look at this. Oh, that was really cool. Was really awesome, man. I remember his R1 was OP, man. We just spam this bad boy. Woo Do you have, like, the right abilities on your weapon? What is going on? Like, I don't even understand what's going on in this map. Um, this is not where I wanted to go. I wanted to go through this door, I think, is the one they want me to go through. Oh, maybe I have to destroy this orb. Uh, nope. It's certainly, most certainly not what we have to do. Perhaps he's already by the Emperor's side. Now we can hope. He's by the Emperor's side, buddy. Oh, man. Hello? Smashing! Look at that. Let the music sing, man. Let the music play. We won't get away. No, when I see this move, I just think that it's gonna heal me. Like the one in the uh, dual mode, that, uh, that card. I think it's the Kaguya card, if I remember correctly. It's a heat aid. come on. Get us up here, boys. Why is that area glowing green? Is there something I must do, or are these the steps they were just showing me? I think they're just showing me what path I need to take. Let's just get up here. Yeah, these are the glowing steps, okay. And, uh... Holy Carpola, man. These little troops, they're thirsty, man. Oh, 
Love this guy, man. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> well, I didn't. I didn't miss it completely, but it missed enough. Yeah, he's in here, Ondra. Hello, Ondra. Good night. Good fight. Open this door. Tahiti, find out what it is. What are you doing? The fuck have you done? And thus, Orochi was born. Holy shit. Holy shit. Where are you? Huh? Where the fuck are you? There he is, huh? You little asshole. S is doing no damage. Holy crap. Get him. Fuck you, Ying Wong. You know, Ying Long was stronger than regular than, than Orochi was, I think. He should have just stayed human. It's, the battle's not over. Son of a. Oh, we have to get the Emperor to get out of here. Just me, help us out, buddy. What the fuck, man? So he broke the mirror. He, he's everything that just he's Ying Long is this entire game is about him. He broke the mirror, he's a Rochi, holy crap. I look forward to our next meeting, let's <laughs> I don't. We already killed you, homie, so just get the hell out of here, man. Demons have appeared, man. Fuck these demons. guys come back. We already saved your life. You've already changed. You've already changed the past. We gotta get out. We gotta get out. Get out, dude. 
Damn, why is why is Fuxi so freaking fast? Holy shit. Trying to have a race? Can I make it to the end before him? Oh, yes. I'm gonna make it! Ah, get fucked. I win. <laughs> My body! Oh, shit. Maybe you should hold it. Oh! Oh, I thought he died or something. Easy! Oh, you're getting attacked by babies over here. That's not a problem. <laughs> Surprise, Iju. <laughs> he's on the verge of defeat. No, he. The, what? No, he's not. Where is he? Oh, he just. Oh, shit, he's right here. He, he lost like half his health right there. Oh my god, if we get attacked by another. Another uh, thing like that, or a Rochi comes back, we gotta kill these archers, man. Come on, go exit. Get out of here, man. There's your problem. We made it, boys. I am finished. <clears throat> the Emperor died still? Oh my god. What? What the hell? Defeat? He made it out of the stage! What the fuck is this?